No, you have the wrong number. Stop calling me. Audrey, what's up? Just reinstalling some of my apps on my new phone. Oh yeah, I'm sorry that Mark accidentally microwaved your phone. How was I supposed to know the phone was in the chicken? Mark, when did you get here? Mark, go home. Fine. Hey, I have to go to track practice. I'll see you later. All right, see you later. Hello? Oh, I'm sorry. I think you have the wrong number. Hello? Stop calling me! Who is that? I don't know. These people keep calling, asking for Jimmy. Are you okay? You seem kind of out of it. I don't know. Oh my god, it's that nugget. I don't want to answer it! I got you, I got you. <laughs> hey, is, is your refrigerator running? Well, then you better go catch it! <laughs> <laughs> Stop, I gotta go to class. Let's go. It's quiet. It's a good one, right? What was that? You see them too? It's like every time I ignore a call, they get closer. That's probably why Daniel can see them, because they answer one of the calls. I think I found something. It's this website that talks about people who can see ghosts after answering calls from unknown numbers. It's by some guy named Captain Nuts. Wait, is that Mr. Janu? Wait, like the teacher at our school? Yeah, I think we should go talk to him and see what he knows. Are you sure? The website says, knock on the door and Captain Nuts lets all enter. That used to be my screen name. I'm Professor Nuts now. Listen, Mr. Janu. I know you know about those phone calls. And I'm getting them. Let me guess, you have a new phone. Yeah. First things first, it's not the phone. It's the phone number. James DeFranco. You know him 
as Jimmy. Hmm? Now, uh, he's a criminal, a murderer. And uh, one night he was being chased by the authorities and he got a call from an unknown number. And uh, he was on the phone and uh, somebody killed him. So the murderer was murdered. Okay, but what does this have to do with me? You see them, right? Yeah, how do you know? Ever since Jimmy died, whoever's been in possession of his phone number starts to see mysterious things and dies. Yeah, uh, it, it, it looks like an accident or a suicide, but people like us, we know that it is more than just a coincidence. <sighs> Sam Johnson, 17, uh, she appeared to have accidentally suffocated. Kiko Smith, 16, she somehow managed to stab herself with a screwdriver. Aaron Visconti jumped from an eight-story building. Jane Wallace, 15. She drank a glass of bleach. She was, uh, she was my niece. What does this all mean? Whoever answers the phone when an unknown number calls. They start to see mysterious things. And if anyone lets it go to voicemail, then the girls, they get closer and closer. And they are the ones who are responsible. Responsible for what? <sighs> Let me explain here by JFK. All right. It all begins with Jimmy. I have to pick up my phone! Just leave it. Come on, let's no, go. No, I have to go! I think it's for you. Hello?